Reddit ads tutorial. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to be telling you how you can use Reddit ads and how you can use it to promote your ads on Reddit. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. Now, when you first come over here onto the site, um, it's a little bit different. The domain name is red ads.reddit.com. So you can go ahead and search for that, or you can just simply search for Reddit ads over here and just simply click the second link ads.reddit.com. This is the important link you just simply click on it and you are good to go you can go over to this one as well but i've found that this one is much better because it takes you directly into the ad building process over here so over here what you're going to do is just simply enter in the company name to appear on your ads then your password company name business and first name last name your number your business website industry country and then just simply sign up so i'm just simply going to fill out this form and I will catch you guys in a second. All right, so once you signed up, this is how it's gonna look like. Now, first, I'm just simply gonna go ahead and verify my email address, and then I'm gonna come back and show you how it looks like. And over here, this is the email that they've sent us, so we're just simply gonna click on Verify Email Address, and now we are good to go. We'll just simply click on Verify Email, and all right, so we are good to go. Now, let me just reload this page. As you can see, we are now verified. Now we are good to go. So over here, as you can see, this is how it's going to look like over here. What you're going to do is you're going to enter in your campaign name. You're going to add in your objective and then the funding of the instrument. So, we, so we'll just say recruitment over here. And then they're going to ask us for our objective. So over here, we have brand awareness and reach traffic or conversions or video views or app installations, right? So what we want is, you know, we'll just say we want to have videos on our views or we want to drive traffic to our website. So we'll just choose that one. And then we will have funding and we have credit card, right? Then we'll just simply click on continue. And then over here, they're going to take us add group where we just simply add the group of our ads, right? This is very popular. So over here, as you can see on the right side, that we have the audience size. So this is the audience that we want to target. So we want to keep it narrow. We don't want to go with, you know, the most with the max because we don't want that. We want to have a targeted specific audience. So let's go ahead and enter in the ad group name. I'm just simply going to call it testing group. And then down below we have audience. So new audience, saved audience, and then we have Reddit audience, right? So we have pixel to retargeting, but we want to have Reddit audience. And then over here, expand the audience automatically so what are the interests so we want to have business and finance we'll choose entertainment and i think that's pretty much it actually we don't want to have entertainment so we'll just go with business and finance right and then we want to search for different communities so over here we will have these different communities so we have announcement we have funny ask Reddit. So over here we have the subscribers as well so over here as you can see 41 million over here for funny and 160 million for announcements so we'll choose that what well, people don't really go with that right let's go with ask reddit as well we'll go with maybe something related to our you know to our objective as well since we choose business so let's go with business over here we will have business so we're going to go with that we'll go with you know the ones that we want to have so let's say we have like a certain call center right so we want to have we require people for call centers so let's go with call call centers over here call center networks all right we'll have call centers and yeah i think that looks good all right now we have more narrow this is what i was talking about. we don't want to go with max we want to have a targeted audience and we're going to have more narrow approach so that looks good then over here we add in the you know location so we'll just say you united states all right we'll choose that and then if we want to have like you know a more narrower approach you could go with maybe narrower but i don't think we can go much more narrow than that actually we can so then what you can do is you can go even narrow like you know maybe target a specific city let's say new york yeah here we go now as you can see we are even more narrow we're targeting a specific audience within that region so the more targeted you get the more narrow you get the more it's going to cost you all right keep that in mind then we have devices over here we want all of them and yeah and then we can add in the carrier so we have at&t 
Nokia Sprite, T-Mobile, Verizon, whichever one you want, you can go with that one. As I said before, the more narrow that your target is, the more it's going to cost you, right? Then we have the placements over here. We want to have the placements of our ads, such as a feed or conversations. We'll just keep it feed so then people can see it on their feed. And then we have delivery as well. So the budget over here is going to be the daily budget that you set and a lifetime budget. So the daily budget, you can put, let's say, $20, right? Nothing too crazy. And then per click ad is going to be over here. You can change that or, you know, whatever works for you. So if this is your first time, you know, using ads or, you know, creating an ad campaign and running it, then I would recommend, you know, you keep your amount, the keep your expenses as low as possible. Let it run for a month. And then when you come back, you see your progress and you see, okay, you know what? It's working. We're getting more traffic. It's working. Then you add in more money to expand it. And then you see if it's still working or not, or if it's still, you know, had an improvement. If it didn't have that much of an improvement and you're spending a lot of money, then down that money and save your costs. So keep that in mind if you're running it for the first time. So over here, this is your daily, you know, limit. So you're going to be able to spend up to $24 per day on this campaign. So over here, and then what you want to do is just simply click on continue. And then you have your details over here, you know, add details, you will have your campaign. And this is basically where you create your whole ad. So you're going to add in the name of your ad. You want to creatives over here post source, post type, and post library over here. And then you want to add a tracker, all right? So so you just want to write something, you know, um, something catchy for your ad so that when people see it, you can see that. So, but it doesn't really matter. You can just simply create a name for your ad as well. So I'm just simply going to call it Zen Media over here. I don't really care. And then you want to have a creatives over here. So over here, you want to have like promoted, or post type is going to be a video, carousel, or images, whatever, right? So we're going to choose a video. And then over here, post library, all right? Let's go with the organic, all right? But since we don't have it, so we'll just create a new post, right? So over here, we'll just simply click on video and upload our video over here. And we can make it, you know, GIF, or we can add a custom thumbnail, or we can even add a destination URL or a display URL. And then we want to have a call to action. So we want to have, let's say over here, we have a bunch of different ones. We have download, install, shop now, view more, uh, sign up, learn more, contact, or whatever we want, right? So we'll just say sign up and we'll add in our destination URL for the ads. So your ad will direct readers here. Double check that, that the link works and meet our requirements, all right? So over here, let's go ahead and add in a, you know, video and we'll just say, and over here, you basically write a headline that's really nice, that's really cool, that when people see it, it's like, you know, a catchy headline, right? This is just for an example over here. You can add anything you want. I'm just simply writing catchy headlines, nothing more. And then down below, you want to add the link where you want people to go ahead and sign up, right? So over here, you basically enter in the, you know, your link, all right? And then you have your display URL and then you want to have, you know, over here, sign up. Now, if you want to allow comments, you could go ahead and allow comments. But if you don't want to, you don't really have to. And then just simply click on submit. So over here, the video is still uploading. So I'm just simply going to let it upload and I'll catch you guys in a second. And then once you have it, you just choose it over here. You add some trackers and you will have a preview over here. And then you just simply click on review and then you are good to go. Then you review it and then you just let it play and then you just send the ad and you are good to go so that is how you use the reddit ads campaign so that is it for this video guys hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible so having said that i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye